Aspain mera jakis nera. Vera darnumen mi aitel asgeri shenki dimatsit. Ethnic cleansing and genocide in Armenia. Upon Aliyev's illegitimate demands, the Armenian authorities, in collusion with the Russian occupying forces and contrary to the will of the Armenian people, are handing over the villages of Berdzor, Sus, and Aravno. Besides being a homeland, these villages are the gates to the Sunik region, the strategic crown jewel for the Azeri Turk dream of geographical unification, which will be left completely vulnerable and subject to further Azeri atrocities. The ethnic cleansing of Berdzor, Sus, and Aravno is the first step in doing the same to what is left of Artsakh, Gharabagh, and eventually Armenia entirely. The blatantly treacherous actions of the Yerevan and Stepanagert regimes are the implementation of the Russian Azerbaijani Turkish plan and are aimed at continuing the full transfer of Artsakh to Azerbaijan. For Russia, this is the prelude to the opening of the only land passage between Russia and Turkey, which Putin's Kremlin plans to implement through the cataclysmic Mehri corridor. The depopulation of the historical and legal territory of the Republic of Armenia, illegally occupied by the Bolsheviks in 1920 and signed off to Azerbaijan by the illegal decisions of the Caucasian Bolshevik Bureau led by Stalin, is unprecedented in that the Armenian authorities are being fully compliant, even resorting to pressuring its own citizens with threats and ultimatums while churches, monuments, and cemeteries are being desecrated. The Russian occupying troops in Artsakh contribute in every possible way to these genocidal acts of ethnic cleansing and once again prove their disloyalty to the stated purpose of their quote, peacekeeping mission, unquote, while the Armenian military leadership continues to remain an obedient tool of the treacherous regime. The National Democratic Alliance seeks the deployment of international peacekeeping forces endowed with the legal mandate of the United Nations as well as preserving the status quo in the Berzor region, Lachin Corridor, as the solution. The current Armenian government is obliged to address the United Nations Security Council as well as the remaining members, France and the United States, of the Minsk Group with this request. Otherwise, the entire responsibility for the catastrophic events that follow, in addition to the responsibility of creating the situation, will fall on them. The Armenian National Democratic Alliance. This letter is being presented to the United Nations, uh, as well as through electronic means. We're here today at the United Nations headquarters, asking for the UN to send peacekeepers to the region of Artsakh. Currently, there's Russian forces there who are occupying the region. And along with the Azeris, they're in the process of ethnically cleansing Armenians from Artsakh. Russia and Azeri, in their imperialistic ways, only understand the language of violence and war. Unfortunately, Armenians' resources, unlike that of Ukraine, are not enough to fend off these murderers. And for that reason, we are asking for peacekeepers to maintain civility in that region. Help Armenia, help humanity. I want to inform everyone about the most appalling or disgusting aspect of the ethnic cleansing or the genocide going on in the Artsakh or Nagorno-Karabakh region of the Republic of Armenia, which is the full cooperation of the Armenian government, supposedly legitimate, uh, with the genocidal enemy. Uh, the central authorities in Yerevan, including Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan, as well as the local uh, authorities in Stepanakert, Nagorno-Karabakh, including Araik Harusunyan, not only they are not doing uh, whatever is in their power and beyond to help their citizens, their, uh, their people, 
and save the country, uh, but they are uh, actively assisting the genocidal enemy to achieve his long dream, uh, dream goal, which is to eradicate Armenia as a state and finally put an end to uh, the physical and cultural presence of Armenians in their own homeland. And they are using every dirty trick in the book to achieve this, uh, every dirty method. Uh, they are um, uh, subjecting their citizens to psychological abuse, uh, spreading sense of despair and hopelessness. Uh, they are using scare tactics in uh, the region of Berzor now, which is in Artsakh or Nagorno-Karabakh and villages of Aravno and uh, Sus to force the local population out of their homes. Uh, they are cutting their electricity and water supply and they have dirty dealings with the Azeri side. Not only they have promised that they will force out the local population out of their homes, but they have promised that Armenians will leave their houses intact, in very good shape for the coming occupying Azeris to settle and enjoy. Uh, and uh, they are using every, as I said, every method uh, possible to achieve this. They're also dismantling the Armenian army and depriving uh, people of any opportunity uh, to do personal self-defense. I want everyone to know that this is a horrendous crime, uh, unprecedented in the history of humankind against its own people by, this, uh, by uh, its own government. And everybody who is dealing with the Armenian government should know they're dealing with criminals. The Armenian government led by Nikol Pashinyan is also manipulating its own citizens and lying about peace with a genocidal enemy that never wants peace with us. I'm Robert Davidian. I'm an American Armenian. I don't speak Armenian, but I am Armenian and um, I care about Armenia very much. I've been there 21 times, and what's happening now is uh, genocide, the beginning of a new genocide or the continuation of the old one. Uh, the uh, Azeri um, peace deal is not really peace. They're still killing Armenians, uh, and they won't stop. Um, so these peacekeepers, quote unquote, that Russia is sending in are just uh, they're to occupy basically uh, Karabakh or Artsakh um, and we, we have to at least acknowledge that and then work to stop it. And maybe the current government in Yerevan is not doing that. Maybe they're doing the opposite. So the, the, important, thing, the important thing is to raise awareness like all these people going by now in New York and we're right in front of the Armenian mission which represents the Armenian government and we are not silent. Menk mer bolokit zainek bartsrasnum, vogch ashkhari hayutyun vodki kangnek. Miasin yekek paykarenk, mi bruns klinenk. Mer ambogch hay jogorte satar petke kangne Artsakhi, Berzori, Aghavnoi, Yevsosi hayutyan bnakchutyan tegahan en anum petke satar kangnek. Kivaki <laughs> Rusastana, Yavayastani Nersum Rusaset Takanka. Yes, coaches of women, Azad, Hai Martun, Miawurbank, Zimven Kajukam, Hamperukam, Melharts and Menk Piti Luthank, and all over Azad Hair Miawurbetin, Melharts and Luthwell. Bajan or Tagervek, Azgain, Jorovertavarakan, Beveri, Yutubian Alikin.